Hey folks, and welcome to this video um, about Ultimate Demon um, beta testing. Um, I've been chosen to beta test Ultimate Demon, and if you watched a few of the other videos, uh, we went through and did several tasks um, with Ultimate Demon, um, and everything we've seen so far has been really nothing but impressive, super, super easy tool to use. Uh, what I want to do now is go ahead and test the RSS function. Uh, this right here is actually bookmarking daemon. We're going to go to, I want to show you the uh, splash screen just in case you haven't watched any of the prior videos uh, to give you a good feel of, of what this product can do and really how easy it is to use. I've used uh, SE Nuke, uh, of course, all of the daemon products before. Um, so, you know, I think that I can make a pretty good comparison between all of the tools. Haven't used them for quite some time. Now, uh, the thing about Ultimate Demon is, one, it's super easy to use. It does everything from, you know, uh, starting your first task. Well, in fact, here I'll show you. Um, the workflow on this is just absolutely amazing, and the folks at Adamsoft did a wonderful job uh, creating this. So essentially, you just create a task. You add the sites, which are already preloaded. You can add more, whether if they're bookmarking sites or... Um, article sites, you set up a profile, which it does for you automatically. You fill in the content, you cut and paste it. You submit the submission time, or you submit it all at once. You save the task, and then you start the submitter. And it really is just that easy. So let's go ahead and hit next. This is going to tell you, and you're going to see me do exactly this, right? Uh, select sites. We're going to create and choose account profile. And we're actually going to create a new account profile. So in previous products, from Edwinsoft, you had to create accounts first, and then you can run your campaigns. Uh, this does it all for you, right? Again, you can spin your articles or spin text uh, actually in the tool, which is fantastic. And uh, that's one of the things I want to do is load the Best Spinner. It has a Best Spinner API, uh, where you can put a Best Spinner API in here. So, and then finally start the submitter. Okay. Now what we're going to do? Let's go ahead and start here. RSS task. All right, and let's go ahead and expand that. We're going to add the sites. And we're adding 17. Uh, let's go ahead and look at the page rank real quick. So a lot of sixes, fives, fours. This is fantastic. So we're going to add those. All right, now it's going to ask us for an account profile. And let's see. Yeah, we're going to add this one here. And I had already set this up a little earlier, uh, just kind of goofing around. And what I'm going to do now is let's go ahead and add in the feed. Uh, now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add in the same site that we were working on before, which is Kupa Usu Benefits. And if you, uh, it's something that I just had pinged as well. So I bookmarked, uh, did a bookmarking campaign, pinged it. Uh, so let's go ahead and put in. Put that in there. All right. And if you're familiar with WordPress, pretty much they all have a feed. It's pretty simple. Put in the website forward slash feed forward slash. Uh, let's go and load URL. Uh, root element is missing. All right. What I had to do is I had to put the www in there. Okay, and here's the title, right? And this actually pulls directly from uh, kabusibenefits.org. Beauty. I'm going to go ahead and put in a quick little blurb there. Okay, Kabusu. Health. Kabusu. I want Kabusu butter. All right, and let's go ahead and throw an antioxidant in there. And weight loss. This uh, Kabusu already ranks. Um, one for weight loss, 
we type in Kubusu weight loss, you're going to see that it already occupies the number one spot. All right, let's go and preview this real quick. All right, close. I'm wondering if we should make that description a little bit longer, but I think I think we're going to be okay. So keep it between 30 and 20 words. We definitely have over 30 words there. Um, so submit now. Tell you what, let's... Uh, curious. Let's go ahead and save. And I told it to submit right away, so um, it's spending no time. It's, it's automatically submitting. Um, so let's see. So four guys, uh, Blog Dyer, Channel Rama. Sorry about the phone there. I'm starting, starting to get uh, Black, Black Friday deals already. All right, and let's see what what it's doing right now is actually creating accounts for um, for this uh, tasks that we're doing, and you can see just how quickly this works. I mean, it's just it's absolutely unbelievable. And uh, yeah, I'm curious to see. All right, let's see. Let's go back to projects. Now, what I'm going to ahead, what I'm going to do is go ahead and um, stop the video. I have a uh, before, but before I do that, the reason why it's able to do this all automatically, as you see, uh, the capture, the capture, is it's I have uh, the captcha uh, API keys loaded, so it's automatically solving the codes in the background. You don't have to do this, but if you don't, then what happens is you have to. Uh, basically sit at your keyboard and type away all of these CAPTCHA codes which is not a big deal if you have 17 sites um, if you have an article directory of say like 4800 sites it becomes really problematic um, or bookmarking you know I have 800 bookmarking sites again very problematic um, and it's, it's dirt cheap uh, so if you get a tool like this, you're going to want to factor in the cost of the decaptures. Uh, but I think it's like two dollars for every thousand uh, solves, so it's really inexpensive and it's it's well worth it. Um, what we're seeing here is look what it's doing already. So not only did it create the account, but it's also um, submitting uh, submitting to these network or to these RSS feeds. So let's let me pull this up real quick, and you can see what's kind of going on here. All right, and see this is what's going on. It's automatically submitting this right to this uh, this RSS, RSS network. And let's go ahead and go back. And you can see it's already eighty-two percent done. Registration and this is kind of nice, right? Registration page not found. Uh, the nice thing about this is that Edmosoft is constantly updating their software. Uh, so if a site changes their registration process, Edmosoft figures it out and they they'll submit an update. Um, one thing about the Edmonsoft products, just to kind of give you an idea here, if you look at this is Ultimate Demon One, right? Bookmarking five blog comment three, um, they're constantly updating their products, um, you know, and, and really it's not about, it's not about a lot of bug fixes, it's always enhancements it seems like. And it looks like we're done. Um, preparing for submission, looks like this one's going to submit here within the minute. Um, what it'll do is it'll retry, you can have it set to retry every, you know, uh, three times every two times and it'll go through there and kind of run on, on autopilot for you uh, which again is a huge time saver so let's see I want to go ahead and show you how, no there we go retrieving IP address account verification RSS micro 
and let's see what happens. Sometimes it has to resubmit because the um, the capture wasn't solved correctly, so it has to go back there and, and try to redo it again. Um, if there's an anti-bot detected, um, see, here we go. Your account was, you know, it, uh, it did it. Uh, if there's an anti-bot software program that's running, it'll sense it, it'll back away, and it'll try it again. Um, so it's really like a game of cat and mouse, and Edwin Soft does a really good job of uh, figuring it out and allowing you to have very, very high, not only submission rates, submission success rates, uh, but account creation rates as well. So um, it's one of the best that I've that I've actually seen. So check this out, right? Decoding image at decapture.com. It's 45% of the way done. Let's see what happens here. Now, if you do see attention required here, you can go to the view logs and the view logs will tell you exactly what needs to be fixed so you can go in there and manually fix it yourself so maybe um, the username was already used you can go in there um, resubmit another account and it'll do everything for you which is pretty slick so it's going to try another one at 11.55.35 or 51.35 excuse me alright went and pulled up the clock and see how the scheduler works And here we go. That's pretty impressive. Again, you're not going to find some of the scheduling, the drip features, really anywhere. Um, the way a lot of these programs work is, you know, you'll load your list, you'll load your accounts, you'll submit, and they'll blast, you know, like your bookmarking sites, or they'll blast your article sites, um, where this has the ability to actually drip it, right? We're not doing any of the dripping features right now because we're not dealing with a lot of sites, and I'm okay with... Uh, you know, submitting 17, 17 sites or um, RSS feeds. And here we got the submitter running again. It's telling telling us exactly what's going on. If I had pinging running, it'll say ping right here as well. And it's trying to retrieve my IP. So if you had several proxies, um, you know, you can use that as well. I use Anchor Free, which seems to work very well, um, and well, it's free. So, yeah, this is really nice. So, and we don't have any more pending tasks. It's completely done. So, I hope that was kind of helpful. Um, you know, it's it's tough to email the folks at Edwin Soft and say, "Hey, this is an issue." I think I might have found one or two things, and, and you know, really they were preference oriented. Outside of that, though. I mean, the, the tool works as as is designed. Um, so even in beta, right? This is not the this is not even the final product. Even in beta, this thing's really impressive. Uh, anyway, I hope this video was helpful for you, um, and it piqued your curiosity a little bit. I know that it's definitely piqued my curiosity as well. And uh, hopefully, I'll have some more updates for you. Uh, make sure you swing by the site and uh, subscribe, and we'll update you as things develop. Signing off, and hope you have a great weekend.